Remember we had uh, Marshall Lothar on here? Yeah. And Marshall was the guy who Scorch was very rude to on his show on yeah. PFG TV. And uh, Marshall got up and said, fuck you, Scorch, and left the show. And Scorch was like, whoa, whoa, what happened? What's going on? And then said, give it up for Marshall. <laughs> yeah, hey, guys, let's hear it. Let's hear it for Marshall one more time, which is bizarre that he would do that. So apparently uh, Marshall wrote me a, uh, an email. That's not the apparently part, but Marshall wrote me an email. He said, so after the podcast dropped last week, Krusty opened up his show about me. I was actually in the chat, but he didn't mention me by name just as a comedian. So I started to email his sponsors and send him their responses. Turns out he took down the video of me. Grimace wins. Thank you for helping me in my small victory. Now <laughs> he's calling Scorch Krusty. I saw. Yes. <laughs> it's just funny. Be so shiny. Oh, so. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so apparently Marshall was not happy with what Scorch did on the show. So he started to reach out to their sp- his sponsors. I don't condone that. Don't reach out to people's sponsors. You know, if you have an issue with someone or a show, take it up with them. You don't have to try to get their money taken away from them. It's fucked up. But anyway, that's what uh, Marsh did. And uh, I actually have the clip of Scorch addressing Marshall. Uh, after this show, I rem- you guys remember what this looked like? He was very dismissive and very rude to this guy. Yeah, he had his phone and all that. Who has a disability? And that was one of the things that the guy wrote to the sponsors. Or like, he makes fun of people with disabilities. Like, oh, that's that's gonna piss some people <laughs> off for sure. Okay. Last week on the show, we had a comedian on. I'm not gonna say his name because it doesn't make a difference anymore. The comedian walks off the set. You know, this sounds like shit, but it's the best sounding Scorch episode yet. <laughs> <laughs> I just realized, I'm like, this audio is garbage, but I can hear what he's saying, so there's that. Yeah, it's a first. All right, so he just said, yeah, the comedian walked out of the set. We, I went after the show. He was still here. And I apologize. I didn't know what I did to tell the God's honest truth, and I'm being serious. I didn't. That's how you know he's lying. The yep. God's honest truth, and I'm being serious. I didn't even know what I did. You were extremely rude to him, Scorch. You were trying to clown him to his face, and people don't like that sometimes. <laughs> what I did when he walked off, we talked it out, and I apologized sincerely, and we hugged it out, and I can... Could... Hold on a second. How do you apologize sincerely if you don't know what you did? <laughs> yeah, right. Honestly, if someone was mad at me and I didn't know that I did anything, I wouldn't apologize. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry you feel that yeah. way. <laughs> I'm sorry you stormed off my show. <laughs> yeah. Prove we hugged it out. Mike, show that picture if you would. Jesus. Oh, he's proving that they, uh, they, I don't know. That doesn't prove hugged, anything. That could have been taken afterwards. at any time. <laughs> Whatever, I believe him. It's yeah, fine. But... Marshall, Marshall doesn't look like he's loving the guy either. No, he's not having fun. <laughs> you know, so, so, I mean, we hugged it out, okay? He said, I, he said, I misunderstood you. It was definitely a misunderstanding. Yeah. He said, I, I, I mi- 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 misunderstood you. I, I appreciate you, and I respect you coming up and apologizing. Just kidding, Marsh. I love you, buddy. <laughs> That's very <laughs> cool. And then what does he do later that night? He starts bad-mouthing the living shit out of mm-hmm. me. He bad-mouthed me to Holly. He bad-mouthed me to some other podcast thing, you know? <laughs> other podcast <laughs> thing. Or, you know, I don't know what that is. Never heard of it, but it's a podcast thing. <laughs> what? Dude. <laughs> If you say we're good, we're good. Now who's stuttering? I don't want to even say anything bad about what was said. I'm not going to say anything about you personally. Lord knows I can, but I'm not going to. Uh, you just, you, you fucked up, dude. Okay, mm. you show that you're not a man. Oh. You are not a man. You get it? Okay, so. Uh, wow. So just- he was just showing the small penis symbol and saying he's not a man. That's fucked up, Scott. Wow, he's hidden below the belt. Yeah, uh, this Quite is a literally. stuttering John playbook. Yeah, it really is. Oh, you went on uh, Carl's show and said bad things about me? Well, then you <coughs> have a small penis. <laughs> You're a pussy <laughs> boy. Yeah. All and right. I could say a lot of things about you, but I'm not going to. But I'm not I gonna, But you are gay. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm not going to say anything about you, gay lord. <laughs> I want to bring it up because it happened. I, I still don't know what I did. You think it's because I was giggling at the chat? Yeah, I. that's oh, what the... Oh, Scorch is trying to pretend now. That he was distracted by the chat, was giggling at that. 
Not that he was being completely rude and yeah. undermining what this guy was trying to do Repeatedly on his show. Repeatedly interrupting him. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So yeah, he's gonna get he's gonna address that real quick. But now he's putting his poor fucking co-host on the spot to be like, stand up for me, please. <laughs> You got my back, right? She's like, yeah, I mean, you were kind of... <laughs> Come on, giant <laughs> crutches. Yeah, yeah, yeah <laughs> <You know>? right. <laughs> That's what I got from it. I mean, because you were doing your cute little hee-hee, and he was trying to talk, and I think he was getting a little flustered with whatever, and then it, I think he thought you were laughing at him, and that's what I talked about and, when I, uh, you know, talked about it with and him. In all honesty, if you know me, and you people watch the show a lot, you know what's going on with the show, you... You know, they're like, I, he says, like, I'm a storyteller. So he started telling a story, and it was just a really slow story. Right. So I was just being me, and I was just like, you know, that's, I, 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 good, I, you know, I was just kind of like just yeah, being me. just being you, but he doesn't uh, know you, so. But for those in the. A guys, huge dick. I was just yeah, being myself. Some people might not know who I am. I'm an asshole. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm the biggest douche you've ever met in your life. And I'm unlikable in every way. That's just me. And you're mad about this? <laughs> What am I supposed to do about it? Change my personality traits for you? For society? Is that what I'm supposed to do? In the chat room that are like, because I'm looking at the chat room now, they're saying this. And the one thing I will bring up is that you're, whoever's saying I made fun of CP, you're out of your GD mind, because I did definitely did not Never. make fun of that disease. Okay. I definitely didn't make fun of the disease. Hell no. no. And I didn't make fun of the dude. No. Okay. I was just me being me. So those that are bitching about it, those that understood said, oh, that's, you know, thank you. Those that are bitching about it, shove it up your ass, too. Ah, uh, you know what, Mike? Come on up here, bro. What an apology. <laughs> yeah. I think any apology that's just shoving up your ass. <laughs> it's pretty good. This episode is. Why, why, why do you feel the need to do that? I don't know. It's because funny. you accomplished nothing with it. Right. It, it didn't. It didn't. No one saw that. And went. Oh, okay. It's just scorch being scorch. I didn't realize. <laughs> He's getting a lot of bad publicity lately. Yeah. Good. Uh, good. And this is. It's even more stuttering, John. Ask where you're like. Oh, I want to learn more about the Trans Siberian Orchestra. That's Christmas extravaganza. Dude. And then you have Scorch <laughs> going on and on about how he bullied a guy with a disability. <laughs> and somebody's like, what, what is he even talking about? Andy, this is so insane. First off, there's 6,200 views on this video from seven days ago. Yeah. Are they buying views? There's only 11 comments. How is that possible? It's not possible. I, he must be buying views. Okay. I'm not, I'm not one of these guys who says everyone's buying views, but on this one, <laughs> I think they're buying views. Uh, secondly, I had to ask Marshall when he sent me this. I go, can you send me a link to the video? I couldn't find it because the thumbnail is the Trans-Siberian Orchestra and the thing says Christmas extravaganza. This came out July 5th and it's promoting <laughs> the Trans-Siberian Orchestra doing Christmas music. Like. There's a giant disconnect here. Yeah. Like, this must be an old that, video. That must be where all the views are from. It's from people that are interested in the trans <laughs> right. or Maybe that's right. Maybe that's right because th what we're watching right now is the beginning of a show. It's 30 and a half minutes in we're, we're into. Does it have this anything is, to do with this trans Siberian is what, this, is what a show, this is what a show is. Look at this. Trim all of this out. It just says, please stand by. What the fuck? And then it, and then it was a countdown after that. <laughs> 22 minutes in. Yes, it goes up forever, Andy. <laughs> it goes up forever. Oh, my God. So that's what Scorch is up to. Holy shit. Who are these podcasts? W-A-T-E.